I hope you remember about my pet, a Labrador female. Her name is Pillow. Recently, she gave birth to seven lovely puppies. Because she went through a lot lately, I thought I had to do something different for her. I brought her to the lake nearby. My brother came with me because he is the official handler of Pillow. And my son, he is two years old with us too. It was the first time Pillow came to a lake. She hasn't seen anything like this before, a large tank. She was so excited about the water. I noticed she is eager to jump into the lake. I wasn't sure whether she can swim. My brother said to me later, she was pulling toward the lake so strong. She was playing with water for a few minutes. Suddenly, she escaped from my brother's grip. At first, I thought she will turn back soon, but she didn't. I was frozen for a moment. I realized she is in danger, but Jane was still in contact. She was uncontrollable. I was stuck with my two years old son. No way I could go rescue Pillow, keeping my son on the shore. He was impatient to jump into the water. My brother is even not a swimmer. His life is also in danger. I was helpless. Nothing I could do except watching. Tense moment. She wasn't responding, seems determined to cross the lake. Luckily, before it was too late, my brother jumped and caught her chain. It was deep enough to cover him completely. Huge relief. They turned towards the shore. She never behaved this obedient ever before. Maybe because it is the first time she tried swimming. The lake is man-made reservoir for agricultural purposes. It starts getting deeper very close to the shore. It is a dangerous place, probably not a good place to learn to swim. Not many people choose to swim here. We used to stay here in the evening because it's a very relaxing place to be. There were lots of possibilities. The chain might get entangled somewhere, somewhere far from the shore. I have seen parts of treetops here and there in the lake during the dry season. In the dry season, the lake water levels goes down. Many people have drowned here in my known history. If she swam further more yards, my brother will not be able to catch her. She may not be able to swim back too. Maybe it doesn't look dangerous because you might not know the background of the lake. But I would say Pillow just skipped a life-threatening incident. A lucky bitch.